everyone, welcome to a, well, it feels like 2016, doesn't it? <laughs> welcome to a 2016 Let's Play. I'm saying that because back then I used to always do Let's Plays without a face cam and that was the norm, but then I introduced face cam later on and uh, now you guys are used to always seeing me in my videos, but, oh, sorry, that was my phone. Um, I am filming without a face cam today because if you guys have been following my posts here on YouTube and on Instagram, I've actually been quite sick for almost two weeks now. Um, and yeah, it's been really tough. I haven't had really energy to film and I've been getting lots of tests done. So I'm hoping to find some answers soon. So hopefully that? we'll... We'll get some tests back and with a bit of luck, they'll be able to easily find what's up. So I can be back to filming like normal again. <laughs> filming like normal and feeling like normal. Um, but yeah, if I'm a little off in this video, that's why, just cause I'm a bit more low on energy, but you know what? I miss you guys so much and I miss filming and I miss playing Sims. So now that I'm feeling like I have a bit of extra energy, I thought, what the heck? Let's just film without the face cam and uh, hopefully you guys won't mind. <laughs> anyway, I mean, we're really focusing on the Sims the most. Um, but just as a recap, you know, it's been a while since our last part, which was part 10. This is part 11 of Growing Together. And uh, Yasmin is finally not pregnant, okay? We've done the hard yards with a lot of birthing of kids. And I really think it's time for Yasmin and Kyle to actually have a break and take care of themselves for once. Um, we've got the twins, Rose and Persephone, who have both aged up and are very different. Persephone is a serial romantic and Rose would like to get a pet and be friend of the animals. So I was thinking maybe we could get a cat or a dog. I, I'm kind of leaning towards cat, which is interesting. Uh, and then Kyle wants to be a super pet. Parent. Little Alpine here is just chilling as an infant. And then we have Clover as well, who is an independent toddler. And um, I think from memory, Kyle is also going through like a midlife crisis right now. Yeah, if we go down here, he wants to practice acting three times. Is that what we were doing? Hmm. It's been a while. I'm, I'm forgetting. Practice acting. I've also done a build in my time off, so there'll be a speed build <laughs> coming out eventually. And um, I've also been looking at some infant CC, so that will uh, be something to look forward to as well. If I just cancel this interaction, can we just do it again and again? Because the the more quickly or the more of these um, challenges that you do, the less length this midlife crisis is going to take. Oh yeah, we're, we're being a little bit cheeky here, but I'm, I'm in the mood for being cheeky. Yay! We'll play an instrument for six hours. We cannot, we can't fake that. Uh, I'm also not sure if I showed you guys my little renovation that I did of the bedrooms. I probably didn't. A little bit of a renovation. This is Persephone's. Persephone is very girly, I felt, and um, very, very typical teen bedroom in terms of posters and fluoro lights and, you know, figuring out how to express yourself. And then over here, this is Rose's bedroom, typical teen room as well with the posters and books and things, um, but a little bit more indie. I think I prefer Rose's room myself, but which room do you guys prefer? This is Clover's bedroom. I thought this was a really nice toddler room. Very simple. I, I love this bathroom so much. I just love the colors. The blue and the yellow look so good and with like the fishies. And this room is ready for Clover to eventually age up into. Um, so that's just got the regular bed. So yeah, that's how the house is looking. Oh yeah, we were gonna burn this crib, that's right. But yeah, it's definitely looking a little bit more full now, which is good, a bit more lived in. Uh, now, I would like um, Yasmin to do something for herself, you know? Why don't we like go for a jog or something? Like you've been doing so much for all of these kids. It's time for you to get to, you know, take care of yourself. Actually, we can go nature walking. You know what, why don't we go nature, nature walking with the, the twins? And actually, because we're right next to this whole like a walking area, we don't even have to go to a loading screen. The perks of living opposite this rec center. <laughs> All right, let's go power walking. A little family power walk, let's go. Meanwhile, Carl's gonna play an instrument. We've got the guitar somewhere. The guitar that Freddie gave us. Ah, practice. All right, so you can go do that for six hours. 
How's little Alpine? I forgot that we also have an infant to take care of. Oh yes, the nanny's here. So can you please feed me? Thank you. Love it when the nanny's here. And then we'll use our diaper and then we'll get nanny oh, to change our diaper. Oh my gosh, I just realized we have like such little money. Okay, after this walk, we might need to um, do some paintings and make some money or at least sell some begonias, which have hopefully started to grow again. Yay, family walk. Now this is, this is wholesome. Oh, also we shouldn't be having any more lag issues like we were having because James upgraded my PC. So that's exciting. Um, Cause we were running into so much lag recently and I was like, oh, oh boy, it's time for an upgrade. Oh, I love it when they, they drink their drink bottles. It's so funny how such a little animation can make such a big difference. <laughs> And Dee Dee. Dee Dee's so, so proud of their grandkids. They just love them so much. You know, Dee Dee's a bit of a funny one, but you have to admit she's very dedicated. And this is so typical with the teens on their phones. I mean, that, that's me now anyway, and I'm not a teen. <laughs> okay, we've been playing an instrument for one hour. Oh boy. That was little Clover. Clover's been so good. They've just been sleeping this whole time. What a sweet kid. Hey, what happened to the nanny? Hey, what are you doing over here? You need to, you need to help me. Help nanny you want to be. Oh, I think we pooped on them and now they're like, I don't want to be this nanny anymore. We can't help it, we had a blowout. Yeah, it's probably best we just go to sleep now, honestly. Try to go night night. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> maybe we actually need to help out our own child. Kids, good night, soothe to sleep, play lullaby. It's gonna be crazy also adding a pet to this family. I don't know if we should get a pet, what, if we should get a cat or a dog. Oh, we are a dog lover. Okay, well then obviously we're gonna get a dog. Uh, that small detail. Maybe we should share some photos with our sister and be like, I really wanna get a pet. What do you think of these cute dogs? See, look at this one. I'm gonna ask mom and dad. <gasps> yes, we have to get a dog. Yeah, look, we're sorry about our kid um, pooing on you, but we do appreciate the help and assistance. <laughs> oh, dang it, we don't have any begonias to sell. Have they gone into our, into our inventory? Sometimes that happens, sadly not. Bummer. Well, there's only one thing to do, and that is sell things on Plopsy. Let's try putting this on Plopsy again. Uh, and maybe we should do some other paintings. Yes, burn that crib. Yes, Rose. Burn it, burn it, burn it. Oh dear, do we do we still have a fear of fire? Maybe that's where the midlife crisis actually did stem from. Oh, we do have a fear of fire. Okay, so if this does catch on fire, it's very important that Kyle puts it out and that way we can beat the fear of fire. This is so satisfying to me. Am I the only one satisfied right now? Oh dear, we have a little bit of a problem. I don't think we have an easel, but it's gonna cost us to buy a new one. I don't know where I put it. I guess I forgot to pack it. I really did think that I packed it though. You know, it's probably here and you guys are probably yelling at me saying it's over there. Don't spend any more money, but I'm sorry, you guys, I can't see it. I can't see it. I'm just gonna pop it there. So let's just do a nice big abstract painting. I once read that abstract paintings can sell for the most. I, I don't know if that's true though. Yay, and you wanted to do that too. Let's give you some food, hey? All right, great news. We have this lovely piece. Let's list it on Plopsy because we know we're gonna get a lot more on Plopsy if it sells, but we can always take it down and do an immediate sale if need be too. Okay, excellent. We have completed that little number. That six hour number. Imagine like just playing your guitar for six hours during a midlife crisis. That's a long time. Sell three paintings to collectors or an art gallery. Oh, we could actually sell. Could we sell Yasmin's paintings? Take photos around the world. Try cross stitching. Oh boy. Well, you know, in all fairness, he does really like knitting and he's really good at knitting. So that's not that crazy. Oh, oh, you're washing. Why is the nanny actually still here? I feel like nanny want to be has been here for so long. I mean, I'm happy about it though. Cause it's a big help. Giving mom and dad some me time. Oh boy, we just, we just made a masterpiece. We could sell it for $1,000 immediately. Oh, we, mm. you know what? Let's do it. We need that quick cash. 
We need it. These are very rare. Uh, they're very rare. No, 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 no. Let's cancel it. Cancel it. Oh, List no. on Plopsy. Oh. There we go. I'm so surprised that Yasmin has so much energy. Oh, but not enough not simoleons. That is, that is sad. <gasps> Begonias! Oh, it's like the heavens are shining down on us. <gasps> Sell them all. Make the money. Yes. Oh, thank God. This is what we need. Oh, coo, coo unlocked. We're missing, we're missing out on this child growing, growing up. Let mama just sell her begonias and then we will, we will help you go to sleep, my love. Oh, we have our tree house pole actually to put up. What is that clip in? Over here. Should have kept the slide. Oh, gay sweet dreams, little one. Kiss, kiss. Mama does love you. Mama's just been having um some mama time. Oh boy. It's okay. Yeah, we'll put on your favorite Jacques Jacques lullaby. Frère Jacques. There you go. Now, now off to sleep. Yeah, getting super sleepy. Ah, much better. All right. Well, it's school time. Nice. We should go to school with them actually. Maybe maybe tell them to eat something. Don't forget to eat. And let's get Rose to butter up Kyle and be like, you're the best dad ever. You are my favorite. Can we get a dog? Because Rose really, really, really wants a dog. And Rose will take care of the dog very well. You'll have to ask your mother. You know, it'll make their days brighter. Having another family member. Oh, what the heck? Okay. Why are you being flirty? That was weird. Maybe she's talking about like... Wait, why are there love hearts? Oh, 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 okay, it was towards Kyle. Jeez, that was a little confusing for a second there. That had me a little worried. All right, Yasmin's back at work as well, so that should help. Um, we need to gift a flower arrangement. I swear Yasmin no longer needs to sleep. She's had so many babies and got such little sleep, now she, like, doesn't need sleep at all. Let's maybe do a red begonia to gift. Actually, no, why would we do that? We should get the cheapest one to gift. Daisies. There we go. The chipper cheap. In the midst of a midlife crisis, Kyle has decided painting is his thing. Oh, okay. So Kyle, I mean, is there? Oh, we we will follow. We'll follow the students. Um, I I think Kyle has like level one painting skill. But you know what? Good on Kyle for wanting to try something different. We love that. And Kyle is a creative sim. Yay, first day of school. Wow, this is miserable weather for the first day of school. It's so cold. Oh my gosh. Also, I think I would like to replace the school with my school that I... I really like my school, okay? Also, who do we have here today to make friends with? We have Lloyd. Okay, Lloyd, the full star. We have Evie, Delgado. We have Carly, Quinn. I think some of these will be your sims. Ariel. Okay, well, let's just um, introduce ourselves to lots of people, make some friends. This sim's cool. They're doing like a tea pose challenge. Ask about that challenge. Yeah, we're making so many friends. Okay, our manners went up. Good, good. Well, I guess it's time to go to math. It's our first big day at school, you guys. Okay, Lily's at the back. I mean, not Lily, Rose. Been watching um, and just like that. And Persephone's at the front of the class. Is Persephone going to be a teacher's pet? Oh, that's the teacher? I thought that was a student. I remember doing like all of these graphs and math things. And I would get so stressed in class that I couldn't keep up with everyone else. I just remember that feeling. I'd only get it in math class. Yay, lunchtime. Persephone would have like a sidekick, you know? Like Persephone's one of the students who, oh, Persephone's having a shower, okay. Wash off the stress from that math class. Because I feel like some people, you know, in a school setting or work setting, you know, they want to have their little buddies right away, usually like two buddies. Whereas I've always been a little more loosey-goosey. I think I've gone off on my own a bit more. I never fit into the, to the clique. I'm always the outcast. <laughs> oh, okay. I love that they're both having a shower during lunch. Oh, a quick change for Persephone. Okay, you weren't feeling the other outfit. All roses by themselves. Okay, Rose, you need to make friends too. Why don't you make friends with... Evie seems cool. Maybe Persephone will get a crush on Lloyd because Lloyd's got like the unbuttoned shirt and the, the mullet, which is like cool. Let's see if we can get to know Floyd a bit more. Oh, and we should decorate our lockers too. Hi, Floyd. Love your body hair. <laughs> 
Oh my god, it's so cold outside. So you're looking hot. Yeah, I'm just gonna, you know, jerk about a few things. Jerk about acne? Is that our acne or his? Maybe let's skip that option. Oh, Lloyd is loyal. Loyal Lloyd. Reveal crush? Yes. What? Their flirtation's going up. Okay. I mean, I guess I did compliment appearance. How much money do you have? <laughs> no, don't ask that. Oh, boy. Oh, look. Look at him look after us. I think that went pretty well. I mean, pretty cool. He's got his, uh, his hiking shorts, his open shirt. It's a look. Shorts to match the hair. Oh, thank God it's not maths, but it is science. I think science is worth worse than maths back in my day. Also, I keep forgetting that Persephone loves dogs as well. And Persephone is adventurous. So I bet seeing the hiking shorts, Persephone was like, heck yes, hiking shorts. And they are very confident. So sitting at the front of the class, good for you. Yeah, end of day report, Persephone. Persephone turned in some good work and took some good notes, and Rose impressed her teachers and learned a lot today. Very good! I am satisfied by all of this. I did want them to have lockers though. Let's get this locker and make it cute. They can have a locker near each other. Because I mean, they're super close. Okay, Rose can decorate the locker with... Let's remove these decorations and start again. Eco-enthusiast? And then I feel like Persephone can go kawaii. Uh, actually, these eco ones are just not doing it for me. What about grunge? What does grunge look like? Oh yeah, that's cool. Oh, uh, I don't know about the butterflies though. Maybe we do need to go gamer. Yeah, that's all right. It works. Persephone should tell Rose about the cute guy. Cute guy. I met the cutest guy. He has hiking shorts. And we totally had a moment at the lockers. And when I left, he watched me as I as I walked away down the hallway. It was totally cute. <laughs> All right, you guys, I think it's time to head home. Today was a good day. Apart from it being freezing outside, I'm kind of obsessed with Evie. <gasps> Evie is talking to him. Stay away from our p potential boyfriend, Evie. Evie. I love how it's like full blown snowing at school. And then when we get home, it's like blue sky. Oh, look at our, um, I was about to say our nanny. <laughs> I mean, that it is a nanny. It's delightful to see you again. No, oh, little one, little, little one. How come just because I left you at home, you're never taken care of unless I micromanage everyone around you? All right, time to read a toddler book. You got to give Clover some attention. Reach stone, milestone unlocked. Excellent. Hey, Rose, can you uh, change your sibling's nappy real quick? There we go. You're going to go to the change table and do it right, oh, right here. Right here. Ah, that's better. The nanny's like, why did you change a diaper right here? You got a whole changing table. Oh, Rose is looking so cute. Okay, you can go to sleep here. Try to go night night. Is this what people do to like help get their baby to sleep? Just walk around the house with the back carrier and the baby in it, hoping they'll just, they'll just go to sleep. Are we gonna sleep with the baby in the back carrier? Oh my Lord, you just dropped them on the ground. Oh dear. Oh, you just stomped on your, your sibling. Okay, Rose, that is not it. This is where dad needs to, to step in. Oh, Yasmin finished another masterpiece? I didn't even tell Yasmin to paint. That's so good. Back on that uh, money-making grind, I see. Let's list that up. That's actually a really nice painting. I haven't seen that one before. Like some houses on a river. That's pretty. If you weren't so strapped for cash, I wouldn't even sell it. Nanny want to be is at this stage just a live-in nanny. Like they are here every day. I don't know if it's like a glitch or something, but it works for me. Okay, Alpine's going to sleep. Don't you dare pick up that baby. <laughs> Why? Why, Yasmin? They literally just went to sleep. No! Oh, these Sims, they're so silly. Oh, okay, then, then just put them on the floor. Monty! Yes! Meet Monty! I love Monty so much. Meet your grandpa, Monty. Hi, Monty. Hi, Papa. Give them a hug. Blow a kiss. Oh, this this is just so cute. I can't believe they haven't met yet. Oh, stop it. My heart. Oh, yay. So cute. Why is Kyle freaking out? I guess still from the midlife crisis. <sighs> All right, Kyle, it is time for you to do what you've always wanted to do. And that is apparently paint. And then sell said paintings to an art gallery. 
Hey, Yasmin, you totally, uh, totally just messed up our, our groove. Yasmin's like, step over. I actually need to make us some money. Okay, well, let's get a nice little cross stitch kit. Put it over here for Kyle to have a go at. Let's um, try a little small hoop with a rainbow in it. Oh no, feeling dazed from contemplating life. Why does Kyle feel this way? Why has life taken such a negative turn? Oh, we gotta get through this midlife crisis. I can't deal with this. Here you go. Nice, nice activity with your hands. Very good for mental health. Perhaps the crib burning next to him isn't helping. And plus we can make $150 from selling that. As much as I did want to see that burn and start a big fire, that would have been awesome. Kyle is not great with fires. You know what, you guys? Like, my computer's been like fully upgraded and there's still lag. So you know what? I think there's just lag anyway. It's it's a lot better. It's not nearly as bad, but no matter what kind of computer you have, I think it's gonna lag a bit. Seems like Kyle's enjoying this. We are so close to Nanny want to be. What a queen. He's crying now. A little bit of a best feed or a bottle feed. Whatever works. <gasps> yes, begonias. Oh, and I forgot about our work assignment. We need to quickly make some daisies and then gift it. Cross stitch is life. Oh, okay, Kyle. Yes. All right, we've done that. Let's put that in our inventory. And you know what? Nanny Wants Be has been just doing so much for us. We're not really sure why, but I feel like Nanny Wants Be is a really nice person. And I think we should show our appreciation by gifting some flowers. Let's gift these daisies. Let's, let's gift our own acceptance letter to university. Okay. <laughs> Here you go. No one likes me. No one will ever like me. Why bother with anything anymore? Oh dear, I guess the hiking short guy hasn't gone so well. Um, people like you, look around. Yeah, look around, don't be so hard on yourself. This is the nicest gift I've ever received. Now it is very, it is very difficult for us to find time for the toddler and infant to interact because their needs, you know, they need a lot. <laughs> so, um, See, I do want them to interact more and they have a lot of interactions. Like if you get Clover to go over to here. Oh, well, when they're awake, should we wake them up? Let's do it. Let's be naughty. Meh, 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 meh. See, you know, they can entertain, they can play and talk about princesses, babble. I mean, they're, they're speaking from afar, but they're interacting right here until the parents interrupt and destroy our sibling relationship progress. Aw, there we go. Finally, some interaction that's not interrupted. Aw, yeah. Raspberry, cute. Dolores is calling. Hey, honey, it's mom. When are you going to come visit? I put all my love and effort into raising you. You can at least drop by once in a while and tell your dear mommy you love her, can't you? Um, I'll visit you tomorrow, okay? We'll come over tomorrow. We should, because the kids haven't even been over there yet and we want to visit. Oh boy, we've sold a painting. It's finally. Chip on Plopsy, nice hundred, $647. Nice, oh, $74. Yes. And we're making friends at school, excellent. And now this is hopefully a moment where both kids will go to bed and we can read them a little bedtime story. No, that's nice. Actually, when are these two little munchkins aging up? Alpine still has three days before aging up and Clover is gonna age up. Oh, today? Okay. Oh, okay, Persephone's not looking that happy. In desperate need of fun. Well, is cooking fun? You know what you two should do? You two should cook a cake for Clover. Let's cook with Persephone a chocolate cake. Would that be fun? That'd be fun, you two. Oh, don't cry. Any second now. Any second now. Okay, it's only gonna take two hours to make a cake, but it's happening. Oh, yes, man, yes, you did another. That is awesome. Another masterpiece. 3,000 simoleons. Definitely lifting on Plopsy. Listing, <laughs> listing it on Plopsy. Oh, Lord. Okay, girls, did you have to start a fire? You know how your dad is about fires and you know how much that stove cost me. Oh, poor Kyle. Hello, how are you doing today? It's delightful to see you again. You, you're you always here. Oh no. And now Yasmin is scared of fires as well. $3,000 down the drain. That is so painful. Oh, dear. 
I just feel like a $3,000 oven should not be catching on fire this much. Can we even afford our bills? Oh gosh, we've got all the kids. I swear our family is fine. <laughs> Everyone's afraid, but Rose is like, guys, stop being so dramatic. I've got this. Oh God, we can't pay our bills. Okay, we're gonna have to, we will have to take um, one of these paintings down from Popsy. Was the cat one the $3,000 one? Uh, now's not a good time, dad. Okay, let's um, let's sell this for 3,000 simoleons. Okay, great, excellent. We can now pay those bills, which means we can now bake that cake. We'll get mom to bake the cake. Just a little less risk. And great news, you guys, we have sold another masterpiece for 4,000 simoleons. Excellent, no one eat that cake. If anyone eats that cake, I will personally kill you. All right, so Clover can have the birthday they deserve. Okay, happy birthday, Clover. Happy birthday to you. You're gonna go out to the front deck because that used to be the tradition. No, you're gonna age up right here because we've got all that routing room. Yay, Clover has aged up and is erratic, okay. And which skill should we pick? I mean, not skill, aspiration from the multi-skill section. So we've done slumber party animal. We've done, we did creative genius, didn't we? Mind and body, playtime captain. We, oh, I can't remember which ones we've done. Well, let's do mind and body. I'm not sure if we've done that. Yay, Clover, welcome. And your bed's all ready, your bedroom's all organized. It's great. And your birthday wasn't forgotten. We love that. Okay, and no more cake because the cake is all we eat. Okay, well, everyone is exhausted. So I'm just gonna put everyone to bed. Um, You know, there's some food here. There's some churros, great, more treats. <laughs> Nanny wants these here as well if you need them. Um, but I'm gonna leave this part right here. Let me know if no face cam was okay for you guys and if you enjoyed it. And as always, thank you guys for your support, your loving messages. And also to the members for sticking around despite there not being um, the extra members content right now. Thank you guys so much for still supporting this channel. It means the world to me. I was trying to put a range hood in, but it's not really happening. Anyway guys, I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you're around the world, and I look forward to speaking to you all soon. Dak Dak!